Air Airlines is a large airline company that operates flights to all major tourist destinations and has a huge IT environment to support their business. They use CA Spectrum to monitor and manage various devices on the network that include switches, routers, and virtual data centers. In addition, they use CA Unified Infrastructure Management CAUIM, to monitor and manage performance and availability across complex environments. Whenever there is any issue in the network devices, alarms are generated by the monitoring tools CA Spectrum and CAUIM. The network administrator refers to these alarms to diagnose and troubleshoot the issues. Often the network administrators face challenges during root cause analysis as they have to check separately the alarms raised by CA Spectrum and CAUIM. The network administrators are happy to know the introduction of Spectrum Gateway Probe that allows bi-directional integration of CA Spectrum and CAUIM. This will help in leveraging CAUIM capabilities of server management and fault management capabilities of CA Spectrum for an end-to-end -end monitoring. It will also allow the administrators to export and correlate CA Spectrum inventory from a global collection to CAUIM inventory. It also provides bi-directional synchronization of alarms, bi-directional clear update of alarms, and view symptomatic CA Spectrum alarms to identify the root cause in CAUIM. Let's view a quick demonstration on how to integrate CA Spectrum with CAUIM and the way you can leverage the benefit of integration. To enable the CA Spectrum and CAUIM bi-directional management option, you will need to perform configuration steps within both products. Let's start with CA Spectrum. Browse the Spectrum Administration Configuration page. Under the Administration tab, click UIM Configuration. Enter the CA UIM Configuration details for the host names and the server ports of UIM and UMP. Then select the Spectro server where you want to list the devices managed by CA UIM. Once done, select the VMware Management checkbox to fetch the VMware inventories and Server Management checkbox to fetch the server inventories from CAUIM to CA Spectrum. We recommend that you enable VMware Management option before the Server Management option. Then select the CA Spectrum UIM Bidirectional Management checkbox to fetch inventories from CA Spectrum to CAUIM and for bidirectional sync of alarms. After selecting the required integration options, click Save. Now log into the admin console of CAUIM. Here you will find the robot of the specified server. Select the same and ensure it's active. The blue circle indicates that the server is active. Click the Probes tab. Select the Spectrum Gateway Probe. This probe enables bi-directional integration of CAUIM and CA Spectrum. Click the Inline Menu button and click Activate from the pop-up menu. Note the probe is activated. To configure, select the Spectrum Gateway Probe and click the Inline Menu button again. Now, click Configure. In the Probe Configuration page, specify the CA Spectrum configuration, which includes the host name, protocol, port, and global collection name of the Spectrum OneClick server. This will allow to fetch information from the CA Spectrum and sync it with CAUIM. Similarly, CAUIM data gets synced with CA Spectrum. Next, specify the full synchronization mode for inventory and alarm configuration. Note, here the full synchronization mode for the inventory configuration is set as daily. Therefore, inventory will be synced daily between CA Spectrum and CAUIM. Further incremental synchronization is specified as 30 minutes. This means any updates in the inventory will be synced in every 30 minutes. Note, the full synchronization mode for alarms is set as hourly. Therefore, in every hour, the alarms will be synced between CA Spectrum and CAUIM. Observe the incremental synchronization for alarms is set as 30 seconds. Therefore, any update to the alarm, such as alarms are cleared or assigned to a troubleshooter, will be synced from source to the destination in every 30 seconds. Select the way you want the alarms to be synchronized, click the drop down arrow, and select Bidirectional option for bidirectional synchronization. In case your CA Spectrum or CA UIM is integrated with any ticketing system, you can get the ticket ID synced by setting the ticket ID custom field. Apart from the set time interval, you can sync alarms and inventories immediately by using the on-demand options. To view the options, click the Actions button. They are Synchronize all alarms now Synchronize all inventory now Update alarms now 
This option can be used to synchronize specific alarms. Update inventory now. This option can be used to synchronize specific inventory. Validate connection. Select this to validate the connectivity. After configuring, click Save. The probe restarts and the full synchronization job runs for inventory and alarm synchronization. The success message confirms that the configuration was written and saved successfully. Next, let's check how the devices are synced at CAUIM. For the purpose of this demo, we have selected the demo underscore GC global collection and it has two devices. Observe those devices are synced in the Unified Service Manager portlet of CAUIM. Now, let's verify the synchronization of CAUIM inventories. Let's search the ESX host that CAUIM is monitoring. Observe three devices are listed. Navigate to the one-click console of CA Spectrum. In the Explorer tab, observe a new container named UIM Manager is added. Here you will find the CA UIM inventories are synced and categorized based on their operating system and technology. Note those three ESX hosts of CA UIM are synced and appearing under UIM inventory. In addition, you can view the upstream connectivity of all inventories in the Topology tab of CA Spectrum. Next, let's see the alarm synchronization. Click the alarm view icon. Set the view into table format to view the list of alarms. Observe the list of alarms generated by CAUIM. The count shows 59. To verify these alarms are synced in CA Spectrum, navigate to the one-click console of CA Spectrum and view the alarms tab. Note the same count of alarms are displayed. Further, to view alarms raised by CA Spectrum and CAUIM separately, enable the Source column. Right-click on the column heading and choose Table Preferences from the menu. Select the Source column and click OK. Notice that the Source column highlights separately the alarms raised by CAUIM and CA Spectrum. Let's navigate to the Unified Service Manager portlet of CAUIM and you can view the alarm generated by CA Spectrum. This ensures the alarms are synchronized between CAUIM and CA Spectrum. Further, let's view how the updates are synchronized. For the purpose of this demo, let's assign a troubleshooter for a few alarms in CAUIM. To do that, first you need to edit the columns. Click the Actions tab and select Edit Columns. The Edit Columns dialog is displayed. Select the Assign To checkboxes and click OK to add the columns. Let's select one CA Spectrum and one CA UIM alarm. Now, to assign Troubleshooter, click Actions and then Assign. The Assign Alarms dialog is displayed. In this situation, let's assign the alarms to the Administrator. So select Administrator and click OK. Observe the alarms are assigned. Now you can view the updates in CA Spectrum. Navigate back to CA Spectrum and enable the Assignment column. Note the alarms assigned to Troubleshooter in CA UIM is now reflected in CA Spectrum. Similarly, if you have configured for synchronizing the ticket ID, you need to enable one of the custom columns in CA UIM through the Edit Columns dialog. In CA Spectrum, you need to enable the Trouble Ticket ID column using the Table Preferences dialog. On the same note, if an alarm is cleared from CA Spectrum, it will be reflected in CA UIM. Let's verify how that works. Select an alarm from the one-click console and click Delete. Click OK to confirm the deletion. Observe the alarm is cleared and the count is reduced. Now let's verify it in CA UIM. Note the update is reflected in the Unified Service Manager portlet of CA UIM. In CA Spectrum, an alarm can be categorized as root cause or symptom. By default, symptoms are not visible in the one-click console. To view, click the Impact tab from the Component Detail pane. Then, expand Symptoms. 
Observe the selected alarm had three symptoms. You can also view the symptoms from CAUIM. Navigate to the Unified Service Manager portlet of CAUIM and click the List View. Find the same alarm that you have viewed in CA Spectrum and click the More button. This displays multiple other buttons. Now, click the Symptoms button. Observe the same symptoms of the selected alarm are displayed. Now let's see how you can synchronize inventory immediately after making any updates. Consider you have to add more devices in your global collection, so select the devices to be added. Right click on the selected devices and click Add To and then Global Collection. The Add and Remove This Model To or From Global Collections dialog is displayed. In this situation, to add the device, select the Global Collection and click the left arrow. This includes the device as a member of the selected Global Collection. Then click OK. Observe the device count has increased for the global collection. Now to perform immediate synchronization, navigate to the admin console of CAUIM and open the probe configuration page. Click Actions and then Update Inventory Now. The success message confirms that the synchronization started. Click Close. Navigate back to the CA Unified Service Manager portal of CAUIM. Observe the updated inventory is synchronized.